Hello guys, welcome back. Please subscribe and hit the bell button. And uh, guys, please join my Discord server. And um, hopefully support me. And um, disclaimer, whatever the problem is here and who makes the problem, please don't go after, don't harass them or any sorts of types of things that they done or miserable things they do. Please do not harass them or like play them in the comment section if they are actually on YouTube or anything. Please don't. It's actually, to be fair, you should have done that because we don't want this problem to get bigger. So let's get right into it, hey? So there was this person named... Um, Sub zero and a bite. Then we have somebody named Sketch. They were actually making Minecraft animations and they also renamed their channel uh, Sketch and Sub the Bite, which is they're doing a collaboration of Minecraft animation and they also do some throwbacks of the old animation they used to do in the same channel, Minecraft animation. And then they invited three YouTubers. It will be Dennis, Coral, and Alex. These three were added into the group for content. And also, made fun together also. Then, once these th four or five people, I should say, is actually in the group you might be like wondering grace why is dennis actually part of the group well i have a backstory to that but i don't know what's the other backstory but i know so far that i know dennis say why dennis is invited because dennis daily is probably one of the most popular youtubers and can keep their audience on the videos like for long there's only two youtubers can do that flamingo and dennis and they picked that dennis um i don't know if albert's is slightly popular in that time or dennis is slightly popular but uh, maybe they just choose one of them maybe albert's not available i don't know but the thing is yeah dennis daily and albert I should say they pick Dennis, so they make daily content together. They make literally daily content, and so many they make daily content as well as their individual channels. They also make daily content on their individual channel channels. Then it actually has been the most popular. I should say gang YouTuber, like of the whole, um, should say three years until 2019 came around, and people have been saying that actually, that's time I actually don't know. Like, they said that people like that is gonna stay in the pals and others are gonna escape. I don't, I don't know, but there's some fake videos, clickbait about that, but. The reason why the Pauls are no more recording videos is because of Coral. The Coral Coral make a big mistake. And remember, don't go out and just, just, don't go out there and try to give them, uh, what you say, um, content or anything. Don't give them attraction. Because... Coral, because Coral said this to actually one of his fans that support and everything. They said, he said, so actually they have been like chilling in Twitter. Then this person named Tiff Stuff was actually one of the biggest fans. And they also bought a new jersey. Uh, I should say a new jersey 
with the pulse on it and she wasted one hundred dollars or what what you want to call it on your currency depends on your country or anything you still have a hundred dollars to get the pole riding in the, the jersey on the sports jersey they came then they actually showed the picture they showed the picture and somebody said somebody said so Cora Horrells um, said you should be this is actually the content is, she said that the content is supposed to be above 12 years old but Tiff stuff is actually 12 but he but Cora Horrell said it's supposed to be above 12 and that's already part of the twist here but about above 12 then they sh this stuff showed the photo again then Cora was like cringe and this one word cringe uh, it's gonna make it's gonna destroy the whole Paul's community in 2019 and when that and once that actually passed by the Paul's going down is going down road because of this one man named Cora Horror. The brand can the brand is no more a brand because Cora Horrell destroyed the brand and it means they stopped recording. So a few I should say time passed by. They also made a video which I which is actually privated. I sh I actually didn't time to record because it was actually privated by the pals and it says that they will be available on every ch on, on their own channels to be fair not their real not the whole group but they're gonna be available in in their individual challenge channels and but but the thing is tiff stuff was getting harassed by youtubers not only fans from the Pauls and anything but YouTubers. And YouTubers were actually getting people, they were like, Are you okay? and everything. Because Carl Horrell called them cringe. Even, even, not only the Roblox, not only the Roblox or a YouTuber or developer, Roblox people are just helping, like harassing her, but the Fortnite community, like, like doesn't even play. Literally no content on uh, Fortnite, uh, no content on, I mean, Roblox is actually really, really mad to uh, Core Horror for, for doing like that. We have example, Mixter V, Shadical, and I don't, and more, more Fortnite YouTubers that, that never even Thing how they play Roblox, they even which is it gone so bad that Coral Horror was banned from uh, YouTube. It gone so bad they they even reported uh, Coral Horror's channel and banned it from YouTube. And also, also they were. He was actually also banned from the Pauls group. Then the Pauls uh, started working individually because, you know, it's not, you know, it's, they can't take that empathy. They can't take that because it can destroy your life. If you, if you like, keep something bad, it might destroy your life about depending on how bad it is. And I think this is the, I think this is one of the baddest situations. So they, do it on the individual channel and they stop. Then, a few months later or five months later, the inactivity between Cora Horrell has begun around these five months. Then, after five months later, we found Cora Horrell. Like, Cora Horrell is back on social media, which is weird. Like, why is he back on social media? I mean, he could have become banned on Discord, but he's actually absolutely blocked.
but he actually tweeted a, a, a air a shotgun. People thought it was actually an air shaft shotgun, like a play shotgun. Like a play, an air off shotgun is actually a type of, uh, it's like a type of, uh, what do you call it? A play shotgun, you know? Like, it seems real, but it's actually fake. And there's nothing, there's no real bullets. It's just rubber, I should say. But it was not the case. <sighs> Mr. Uh, Kaneko Kin's friend, John Roblox, immediately noticed that it's a Mossberg shotgun. Already. They already know it's a Mossberg shotgun. Straight away, off, right off the bat, they said it's a Mossberg shotgun. And people were afraid because it's just... You're afraid for the pals and everything. Because usually, guns have content in it. While Coral Horror didn't have any content in the... In the pictures, and also a, a there is a bit like the emotions expressing here. It's like scary or worried, and if we compare to other gun pictures, they put captions. They also put they also put like smiley faces or anything, but they didn't. But this one didn't, and we we're like, oh, it's actually. Just, it's actually really uh, sad to see because, like, is this how you literally change? Is this how what you become right now? Like, we are worried because of the policy safety and everything. Who knows? Because they because this person knows all their house addresses. I should say house house. Uh, like they know their house. They know their house address and everything. Because of course they're the pals. So they, they might even know their house addresses because it's their their group, their fan group. But they still will remember every single houses, even even though he's banned from the fan group, he will still become. You still know. You still know because he will still remember it. And we're like, oh no. Then somebody found. Actually, it was actually a few days later. Somebody found this. They said, Coral Horror was online 15 hours ago. And we were like, what? On Roblox. It says, 15 hours ago, Coral Horror was online on Roblox. Looks like, on my opinion, he liked the game. Looks like Coral Horror liked the game. And they also have the new premium. Which is pretty weird, but I think Roblox... Core Hole is just running around in Roblox. But I actually wonder. People will recognize him and they will know the situation. What will he actually feel? Like in this point. Like people will know example, people will know who he is and know the situation, like what's happening. I wonder what they're gonna be their impression with what they're gonna say. Or maybe he just hops in the all account so no one can question him. And there's also going to be fans, like, questioning, like, why are you online? Maybe. And he's actually also banned from YouTube, so... Because of the reports. And I guess that's enough for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this YouTube video. Well, it has been 14 hours. I mean, 14 minutes, I'm sorry. But... I actually would like to do an interview with him about, like, what does he feel on his side? Not about, like, about the problem, I mean. So, I would actually want to see, like, his perspective of the problem. And I want to see his response about why does he do this? I just want to know. I just really want to know. Because understanding people's problems on the other side of the perspective is the better way to solve the problem. Anyway, guys, thank you so much 
for this rise and fall series and please support me subscribe to my channel uh also nobody has joined my discord server guys we also have a fan art contest and also some other cool stuff in store because and we don't we're not starting it yet because we need more people that's why we're not starting the fan art contest or anything and the link is down in the description below and guys thank you so much for supporting and Hope to see you guys all next time. Good. Bye.